reflection Without a follow, without a mention You really piping up on these niggas You gotta be nice for what to these niggas I understand Hey guys, welcome back to my channel So I don't know what all the time we've been But anyways, today I'm doing like a, like a spring glowy makeup look Because, I mean it's supposed to be spring But right now it's raining outside But we're just going to pretend it's spring right now and I'm gonna do like a really like bronzy, silvery, bronzy, silvery, like a like a brownie, silvery eye. I think. Um, you'll see when I do it. Um, but yes. Yeah, so, because it's spring, spring. Um, I thought I'd put my hair back with some sunglasses instead of my Minnie Mouse's. Um, and yeah, can we just ignore the fact that my glasses are? rose gold and the rest of my jewellery is gold um, let's just put that on one side and let's just get started with this makeup tutorial so I've already done my eyebrows and primed my eyelids because you know I'm ahead of the game and now I'm going to take um, let's what brush should I take I'm going to take my new brush that I bought the other day um, I'm taking this Morphe M139 tapered blending crease kind of brush and I'm just going to take the shade extra bitter from this naked ultimate basics palette and I'm just going to put that in my crease and add a transition kind of colour and now I'm just going to take this new look blending brush just to blend out the edges Now that's all that's all done i'm gonna take this revolution let's try and read what it says Where's revolution e103 brush and i'm gonna take the shade uh faith in my crease And now I'm going to take the naked, actually, hold up. I'm just going to go in with that Urban Decay palette again. And, um, I need a suitable brush. With this new look pencil kind of brush. Um, is that what they're called? Pencil shape brushes? I have no idea. Um, I'm going to take the shade Lethal, which is like this dark purple, in the ultimate basics palette and put them in my outer corner i'm gonna make this really messy and i'll clean it up later and now i'm gonna take that blending brush again actually now i'm gonna take the, the um, crease brush that i used from revolution Now that my makeup looks awful, I'm going to try and, you know, jazz it up a bit by using a shimmery shade. And I'm going to take the naked, this is just the naked one, I think it's called. Um, and I'm going to take all these colours, are so pretty, I haven't used them in ages. Um, I'm going to take the shade Sidecar. Uh, I'm going to take this Revolution E101, like, flat brush. And... I'm gonna not I'm not gonna spray my brush, I'm just gonna see how it performs by itself. Okay, so it's shit by itself, so I'm gonna take my fix plus and spray that bitch. Right, let's try again, shall we? more often actually oh my god my eyes are so pretty I'm gonna take that same pencil brush just to like mix both colours together mix blend girl it's blend we're doing a makeup tutorial it's blend we're not baking it's blend it's so cute 
Right, now we've got to clean up that awful mess that we just made. So I'm going to take uh, a little, what do you call these, cotton pad. And some makeup remover. Everything's so far away, I can't even. My arms just don't stretch that far. I'm going to like fold the cotton pad over. My cat is snoring in the background and it's really pissing me off. You probably can't hear it, but I can hear it loud and clear. And girl, it's not cute. Snatched. Okay, now I don't want a harsh line. So I'm going to take that tapered crease brush from Morphe. And just like blend out the edge. Right, we're going to come back to the eyes later to finish them off. Right now, I'm going to prime my face. So I'm going to quickly do that off camera. Well, I might just speed it up. Um, but I'm going to use the L'Oreal 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 um, Infallible Mattifying Base. And then over the top of that, I'm going to take the Nivea Post Shave Balm. Because I haven't used this in a hot minute. And... You know what, I've been loving it recently, so it's back in my makeup routine. guys in just a tiny little bit um so you can see my face up close even though you probably don't want to and you'd probably rather see me do my shit up close but I'm just gonna roll with it so now that my primer has like set into my face a bit um I'm gonna take my foundation and I'm gonna use the Rimmel Last and Finish 25 hour comfort serum foundation I honestly holy grail holy grail foundation um, I've always used this foundation, love it, like, love it, and mine's in the shade 400 Natural Beige, and I'm just going to dot that around my face. Oh, did I say I'm using my blending, blending, beauty blender, sponge, real techniques thing, to, um, buff in the eyeshadow, eyeshadow, oh my gosh! Foundation. I'm just losing it today. You know what's my favourite sport? Trying to blend in my foundation without ruining the brows and the eyeshadow. It's an extreme sport, okay? Like, no one come for me. It's an extreme sport and I don't like to play. did my foundation off camera because it was pissing me off because I was literally ruining my eyebrows and I just wasn't having it so I did it off camera so now I'm about to do concealer I'm using the NYX HD Studio Concealer in um, 05 medium and I'm just going to put it under my eyes on my, on my spots, chin, nose, around my nose and my forehead <laughs> this RCMA powder this no colour powder it literally looks like a pot of flour um, because it's so white but it's really good I'm loving it at the moment I'm going to pour it into this like old lid that I don't use complexion I'm going to pour it into there and I'm a bake <laughs> poured out too much powder and so now I'm having to use it up because I can't exactly pour it back into the pot 
Yeah, that's how my life is going right now. So now I'm like all caked up. Um, I'm gonna set the rest of my face with. Uh, oh my god, what's it called? Rimmel Stay Matte. And it's right here. And I'm just gonna take that on a big fluffy powder brush. And I'm gonna use the Revolution F104 brush. And I'm gonna set the rest of my face. even more of a mess and caked up mess I'm trying to sit on my, my powder to like sit into my face a little bit so I'll be right back once this is off my face who else is loving Drake's new song because I am yeah, she does a song okay we're back bitches um, I just took off my powder my memory card was full so I just went and emptied that um and now we're about to move on and i really want to do five, five freckles and i like watch loads of youtube videos and they always do their five freckles before like powder and highlighter to make it like more like natural with the skin so do we do that now because um, i'm gonna do that now so i realized i just started a sentence and didn't finish it um I'm gonna take this really skinny, the skinny queen, um, Real Techniques fine liner brush and my Urban Decay Naked Basics. Is that what it's called? Yeah. And I'm gonna take the shade Lookout because it's like this medium brown colour and I'm gonna dot that around like this area and like a few on my forehead. I was about to call that my chin then. I was like, no, hun. It's a forehead, not a chin. Um, so, uh, yeah. Okay, so now that I look like a hot mess because it's not blended and I just look fake as fuck, I'm just gonna take my beauty blender and just like really pack into my skin. Honestly, is there anyone out there? That has freckles and hates their freckles i will happily take them for you um so we can do like a quick swap if you just don't want a no freckle face so now i should really get my product out before i start talking shouldn't i i'm gonna take my saint tropez powder bronzer you know i love this stuff um unfortunately i've hit pan and i'm really upset about that because I bought this in TK Maxx, so I don't even know if you can still like buy this anymore because it could be like a discontinued product. But I'm gonna search the web and try and find it because I love it. But is it so expensive as well? It's like twenty-one pounds. Oh. We love a bronzed goddess. over the freckles on this side of my face because I kind of lost them whilst I was bronzing because I kind of went a bit too heavy on the bronzer but oh well okay great now that we're evenly freckled I'm gonna take I'm gonna take my max max mac fix plus and just spray that around my face um, and then we're gonna move into highlighter because highlighter always pops more once you spray your face a little bit and then highlight so I'm gonna do that. Actually, no, I haven't finished my eyes. I'm gonna take this, that Revolution crease brush again and take the shade, extra bit of the first shade we used and run that under my eye. I'm gonna take Leafle as well, the dark shade that we used in the outer corner on the outer corners again. So now that that's done, now I'm going to spray my face with MAC Fix Plus. Now I'm just going to quickly take, put um, some false eyelashes on. But I'm going to do that off camera because your girl cannot put false eyelashes on 
to save her life so i'll be like right back so i've just put my lashes on and i literally feel and look like yaz online and you know what i'm not mad about that because that girl's beauty so now we are gone highlight so oh my highlight here <laughs> i'm gonna take my mac soft and gentle mineralized mineral mineralized skin finish because i love this stuff on i'm gonna use this brush raw techniques this is the contour brush i think but it's like all rubbed away so you use it too much girl look at that highlight Now to top this look all together before setting spray, I'm going to take this clear gloss from New Look, it's just a really cheap gloss. Okay, now I'm going to use the NYX matte finish spray, <laughs> that was so annoying, matte finish setting spray. You know what? I have no idea why I kept my eyes open whilst doing that because that was the most stupidest thing I think I've ever done. I'm just going to quickly add some bottom lash mascara and then this makeup look will be over. Now this is the finished makeup look. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching. Um, it was so different for me to film because I've obviously never done faux course before. And I hope you did like this video. I think I've just said that. Um, and if you did... Make sure to smash a massive thumbs up. Um, subscribe if you're new or if you haven't already because you're just plain rude if you haven't subscribed. I'm joking, but please do subscribe. And comment down below anything. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. So, bye. Bye.